You ever shank putts? You ever shank your hairline? <laughs> Go. Bro. I don't know always miss my butts, but when I do, I leave them two feet short. What? All right, guys, we are back with another GM Golf video. Today, we are down in Florida, West Palm Beach area, out here at PGA National, playing the hardest stretch of holes in golf, arguably, the Bear Trap. It's a three-hole stretch. We're playing with Andrew Jensen. Yes. You guys don't already subscribe to him. The link will be in the description down below. The teams are going to be Steven and Andrew versus me and Matt. Scramble. We have played, how many holes have we played? We played 14. 14 holes. That's going to be on Andrew's channel. He did like an overview. And honestly, I've been playing kind of trash the first 14 holes. Matt, He's how not, you been? I, well, we're left, right, bottom, up in the trees. All right, let's dive right Green in. Driver. All right, G-Money Rat, we've got 167 to the pin. All right, guys, so the first hole of the bear trap, hole 15, is a par 3, 159 yards straight into the wind. And you guys might be thinking, 160 yards, not that hard. Well, there's a ton of water right. And today, that water's definitely in play. So I'm gonna be hitting, yeah, probably a seven iron. Knock Thanks. down seven. What are you hitting? I got a nine iron in my hand right now. Why do you have a nine iron? It's straight into the wind. I, I couldn't find my eight iron. Maybe you should hit nine iron, honestly. All right, Steven's just trying to get one in play on the left side. And he did, he did just that. Okay, uh -huh. partner, I'm on the green, you got this. <laughs> in total, between all four of us, we got eight hours of sleep last night. I got one and a half hours. Pull a couple hours in. I got a couple. A couple I minutes. I think I got between three and four. Well, we know who's carrying the team. Right. Oh, sit oh, the hell down. Okay, that is definitely the place to miss, though. No. Oh, okay, good. Oh, Wait, yeah, he's fine. All right, Matthew Gene Shart out here trying to with an eight iron. You're in an eight? Look Oops. at these horse lives. Oh. Go. If it goes, that it goes, it's great. You're fine. Come on, give me something. Yes! Oh, man. oh, he's got a yes. putt. He's on the oh. green. What do you got, Garrett? I got seven iron. Nice little seven iron. What did you do? I just tried to knock it down. Oh. Okay. That's where Andrew's balling it up and he made a little comment saying he's closer than Matt's ball and they're not even on the green, which I don't know if that's true. Here, give me the putter. Yeah, it's something right, about you. Bermuda grass. I don't even know what that means. Steven's putting this from 35 yards away. That's what Andrew is suggesting. Oh. Sit down. Andrew is going to hit the chip shot. Getting up and down for par here would be ideal. A little bump and run. He kind of checked on you. Yeah. It's not bad though. You guys got that for par. Let's keep this in mind, guys. Matt is about 25 yards long of the pin. If you miss that a little bit more right and short, like, there's nothing. Nothing. All right, down the hill, guys. This is what we're looking at. Um, probably a little right to left. Pretty speedy putt. Oh, that's... Oh, dude. No way. No, bro. I don't always miss my putts. But when I do, I leave them two feet short. Here, now, he's got himself a free looking, schmucking, booking, cooking, looking. He can just go ahead and go for it. No need to, to get frisky with it. Dude, speaking of frisky waffles, yeah, yeah, yeah. I'm gonna follow this on Buck all the way to the hole. We're gonna trickle it right on in, trickle in, ESPN. Free run now, just leave it short. Dude, that's not as fast as I thought. All right, Steven here up the hill, four par. This is to that's have the hole. Great putt. <laughs> you ever shank putts? You ever shank your hairline? <laughs> Andrew up the hill. This is to tie the hole. What a great putt. The guy's on fire. The guy's a beast. The guy is a beast. Solid start to the bear trap. Matt actually started out with a par by himself. I didn't even really help on that hole. On to hole 16, which is a par four. Um, probably one of the tougher ones on the bear trap. I mean, they're all tough. I don't even know how to rank them, but this should be interesting. Bro, first time playing the bear trap. You made a par by yourself. I made a par. You know what pars are? You know what cars are? That's very rare for you, because you like went plus 95 on the first eight to five holes. I'm tired. Dude, we're all tired. I don't know what I'm doing here. We're delirious. Steven wants to make a little bet, not really sure why, but... We're in Florida, you gotta do, there's something you gotta be able to do here. When you lose, what, what do you guys wanna do? 
we have the bet. Whoever loses has to crack open this coconut and drink it. Bro, low key, I'm gonna lose on purpose. Them things are fire. Losers have to crack it open, winners get to drink. Okay. Oh, oh dang. Yeah. That's so when you guys lose, don't cry about it. Shut up. You talking again? He's mad about the rematch. We're gonna have another rematch on his channel. And if this video gets 10,000 likes, no, 11,000. You know, the rematch is gonna be 15,000 likes were boxing. The rematch is gonna be I'm gloves. beating you up. You're not doing nothing. 15,000 likes? Dude. I don't know. Shut up. Like, usually you get about 15,000 views, so if everybody likes it, you <laughs> Here's another one the rose. All I'm saying is Fix It Felix over here needs to fix his golf game because it's complete trash right now. All right, Steven up here first, trying to get one in play, hitting the Steven fade. Right that top. one's going to be a little right there. It might be in the grass, though. Can you tell me what I'm doing right? That shot tracer might be out of the screen. That's the last ball we got. So, now that Steven is right and in the water, that's about where he went. Andrew is going to tee up an iron here and try and get one in play. How the heck do I slice it so far? Well, you, that one hit right off the toe. Okay, I don't want to talk to you, Unibrow. Oh, that's clean, Mike. I messed up on purpose, so it makes him play a little better. And Matt hitting a hybrid here been his favorite club of the day that is so good guys straight down high ball flight middle of the fairway all right so g rap fart now oh that was almost good Bunk. apparently we have 187 yards from matt's ball right over there matt just pulled out his rangefinder even though andrew literally just all right, whatever gets it done, but that's what we're looking at. So this is where my ball was, just in the right bunker. Uh, I said it was going to be good if it cleared the bunker, but apparently it wouldn't have been because it would have been in the water. All right, 187, Matt, what's the deal here? Well, the deal is the wind's going right inside my mouth all that way, so I got five iron in hand. I don't even know if that'll get there. I got to keep it like low and go and drop low stuff. Hi. Oh, little stinger. Bro. Way too low. <laughs> Good little. Shot. I didn't want it to go that low, but that was what I wanted to do. So Garrett now has probably got a four iron in hand, looking like a giant toe. And he's probably going to try and keep it a little low as well. This is a tough hole. Tough okay. pin. Bunky junky up there in the top. Literal maniac going straight left. I love you for that. Really great shot. Partner. I kept it low. Garrett, give me some knuckles for that. All right, 183 for Steve-O here from Andrew's Ball. This is a nice little sting under the wind. Stinger Steve with a high brid. Oh. <laughs> Go in the hole. Go that? in the hole. What is that? Oh, oh my god! Just short. Dude, that looks so yeah, good. That was a good shot, though. Didn't that look like, like crispy? Like a Matt's hairline? <laughs> For Andrew trying to put one on the green. What's the club of choice? I think it's six iron. What? That looks okay. so good if it goes. Well, Matt, um, so here's where mine ended up. This is the green undulation. I don't know if you guys can see it, but it goes so hard from back to front. Matt's shot's not going to be easy, but it'll probably be better than mine. We're going to take his. Yeah, we have a couple options. Obviously, we can chip it. That's what everybody probably would do in this situation, but you can definitely putt this as well. It goes straight down the hill. There's a mountain there about as big as Steven. Just kind of screwed. What are, you, what are you trying to tell me, Garrett? We have I, no chance? Yeah, we don't have any chance. All right, well, I'll chip you putt then. All right, sounds good. Break. I don't know if you guys can really tell on camera. It's really always hard to see undulation, but right about there, it slopes down the hill a ton. Just trying to die it at the top of the hill here. That's what we're talking about. Look at that run away and to the right. Wow. All right, you're chipping it too. Okay, I like the. Just go farther than that. Try to make it. Oh my. You literal beast. Yes, sir. That's what we needed, bro. If you didn't hit the hole, might have been water. Team Steven and Andrew, they're doing some deep analysis on this putt. Steven's gonna leave that one three miles Andrew, short. Andrew, I think I left it short, baby, woo! I tapped it like it was about a one foot. He said go for a four footer, which would have been good, but four for four at Wendy's, can't beat it. Better speed, but that's just a tough putt. All right, Steven's just bold strategy, just going and... Nice. Oh, well done. Garrett and Matt right here, four par. I just want to thank Andrew. Oh my God! <laughs> All right, Garrett to save par. Okay. Way there we go. Dude, no, we're going one up, boys. 
All I gotta say, Andrew, we're gonna be drinking some coconut later. Mm. After our second hole, hole 16, Matt and I are now one down, one over. Did you guys give yourself a team name? We're just... Team Coconuts. <laughs> and we're Team Juice. <laughs> <laughs> I'm not about to be feeding them coconuts, so you get a grip. All right, so the goal here is just to get it over the water this hole 17, par three, Sunday pin, all the way on the back right over there, guys. And we're 200. in the way back. This is the farthest tee box back, over 200 yards, straight into the wind. Steven. Oh. Sliced it too much. Too much. Why do you have five? Because I was using your driving iron, because that you brought a shtira bush I am a driving iron. Is that a 21 degree wedge? Can we record? Anyway, uh, Andrew here with a four iron, trying to just get one on the green. Oh my gosh, I mean, that's pissing me off. Right at it. Play, man. You don't have to play good when you have Andrew. Push it, and it works. <laughs> All right, Matt Eugene shart his pants up here. Oh. All right. All Where's it going? Me, Where's it going? Oh. It's right. It's in the water. All right, Garrett really needs to hit some type of grass on the left side. Oh, what? Yes. Oh, oh my God. Sit down. Sit down. Oh, bro, let's go. Almost quit it. It's gonna be good cracking up coconuts. There's no way. Oh, honestly, guys, I'm just happy I hit such a good shot, dude. We are closer than Andrew. Just so you guys know, editor, please play that clip. They're still away. They're still away. Out of all the holes I've played today, out of all the holes we've played today, that was probably one of the best shots I've hit all day. Um, just haven't been playing the best recently. Guys, Andrew just pointed this out. This is where I landed. Uh, that almost one hopped in. Wow. Also, just so you guys know, this is where Andrew's ball partner. ended up on the front side of the green. Steven up the hill for birdie. Oh, that looks really solid putt, though. But Bart, we can chip this in. We're going to chip this We're in. We're chipping it in. We need you horsefly. horsefly. You're going to be that big horsefly on my mini horse. All right, Andrew, Mike could post that screenshot of that on his Instagram. Solid putt, solid putt. Good two putt for par. That's three pars, Andrew. That is three Andrew, pars. Andrew's carrying. I haven't done nothing. So you guys have to hold this to tie to force sudden death. Yeah. All right, Matt here down the hill needs to make this to force a sudden death playoff hole. God, I gave that a good run. Yeah, good shot. Solid shot, solid right. shot. It's got to stay up more than that, you shamaka. Well, we're going to be uh, cracking coconuts. Yeah. So, all right, Andrew. Well played. That's a wrap for the golf part of this video. We're gonna go back to the Airbnb, crack some coconuts on their faces. I want the coconut to be a little sweet. If you have to put a little, yeah, answer it. Hello? This is Patrick. Oh, dude, no way. All right. Oh. Oh, bro, you ready? It's open. Ah. What the? Bro, ain't nothing in here. Bro, there's no. No, you gotta get. Hold on. Come on, drip. Crack that right thing there. open better. Practice with my hands. You guys see that straight power. Guys, there's some juice. Use somewhere the corner. Here. Just crack open. There's more juice than three drops. Yeah. yeah. Oh, every on. time you hold on. See, it sprays out. Look like Neanderthals. <laughs> oh, <Dude>. yes. <laughs> Let me get your mouth over here. Oh, it's disgusting. <laughs> <laughs> That's disgusting. Throw it down. <laughs> ah, I ain't trying. Why, why That's stupid. Bro, that is gross. Crack this open so I can eat, eat some of that yellow stuff in there. Oh, there is. Oh, there's oh, no way that's good. Oh, no, that stuff's gonna be good. Yeah, yeah bro, that right. looks like salmon. You I'm so been... confident. Uh, in too. You said, Man, just so you guys know, terrible. Micah has arrived. He <laughs> arrived in Florida. Um, anyway, guys, hopefully you did enjoy today's video. If you haven't checked out Andrew's channel uh, yet, it's gonna be linked in the description down below. Also, it was a lot of fun. This challenge, bear trap, Matt's or Micah's smashing coconut that still. Bro, why is he drinking that? That's disgusting. Yeah. No. That's about it, guys. Hopefully you did enjoy. If you did, be sure. Dude, I, I, I thought it was gonna be way worse than that. <laughs>